Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this Flutter tutorial we are going to learn about uh, page view widget in Flutter. So I created this project in which I have this uh, run app method which is calling this my app class and this my app class is in turn calling this uh, um, page uh, view class here in the body and we have created this app bar and this scaffold. Now, uh, as you can see, this build method uh, return a widget. So we will return the page view widget here. So I'll write return uh, page view widget. And now inside this, we will uh, put some properties of this uh, uh, page view widget. But before uh, we will create page controller here at the top so page controller uh, page uh, controller equals page controller and it take the initial uh, page here so we'll uh, pass in the zero index and now i'll put semicolon here now this is complete now we will come to this uh, page view widget now it has a uh, property called scroll uh, direction and we will use horizontal so x is dot control space and horizontal now the next thing is take is uh, controller so i'll use controller and i'll pass in page controller now the next thing is uh, it has a property called children and now uh, this will return a list of widget so we will use here now I will go inside this list and here I will use uh, the first which is is container and here in this container I'll uh, use a child and child will be center and inside the center I'm gonna use text widget and inside this text I'll pass in um, this is the first page and now I will use a uh, style on this and text style and uh, I will use font uh, size and I will use 18 for font size so I have to use child here uh, because it is showing error so it will be the child of the center widget now it will stop showing error now you can see that it has stopped showing error i will give a color to this uh, container so i'll use color and i will use colors dot uh, blue and now i'll copy this container up to here control c this now I'll put a comma at the end of this and now I'll control it here and then I will put a comma and uh, a third time. So I will use this uh, as second page. This is the second page and this is the third and I will use uh, color dot uh, red and I will use color dot uh, 
dot uh, yellow now let's run the app and let's check it if it is working so I will run this so the application is running on blue stack so let's check it I'll go to blue stack and then now I will scroll this as you can see uh, I can scroll to these pages this is the third page this is the second page and uh, this is the uh, uh, first page now let's uh, implement on page change so for that we will go to this code and now here I will uh, use on page changed and here I will use parenthesis and inside this parenthesis I will use the index um, and then curly braces and then I will print here the um, page index is dollar index and now I'll put semicolon here now I will rerun the application uh, on blue stack now the application is running on the device so on blue stack so I'll go to blue stack and now if I scroll this page now you can see that the page index is one because we um, from zero we came to this one uh, and now if I scroll again now the page index is zero uh, two because we goes to the third uh, page and uh, then this is starts from zero so zero one two now if I scroll back I go to device again scroll back this is uh, one and this will be index zero so that's all for today I hope you like the video if you like the video please like subscribe and comment thank you